Now to innovators, where we look at some of the groundbreaking innovations transforming the world. Some innovators improve something old. Others discover something new. And then every once in a while, there's an innovator who completely remakes reality. Ariel Garten of Interaxon is one of those innovators. She's developing a technology that will allow you to control your household and all your electronics using just your thoughts. Take a look. Ariel Garten is controlling the universe with her mind. As I focus on the form, I can allow it to rotate, or I can just relax and let go and increase my alpha waves for the galaxy to flatten out. Being able to control stuff with your mind really is a breakthrough. It's a new way to engage with the world. Garten is CEO and co-founder of Interaxon, a Canadian company that's working on a way to connect with electronics using no mouse, no hand gestures, just thoughts. It's going to kind of fundamentally change the way that we understand technology and technology understands us. For now, the technology is pretty simple, a headset with a single sensor. But the sensor sends out one signal if you concentrate, another if you relax. So what you've got here are my brainwaves. This is what my raw brainwave looks like. The company is researching whether it can be used to control household objects, like this chair that Garten moves up by relaxing her mind. Or 3D computer games like this. Paula here is playing this game. She's not touching anything. She's just, you know, engaging completely, using her thoughts. Chris Amini is Interaxon CTO and game designer. So the more you think about something, so the more you're doing mental processing, the more wood you'll burn and the more smoke you'll actually produce. When you're in this sort of relaxed, meditative state, you'll see the birds come out and glide around very slowly. You'll hear them as well in the audio. Hard to believe, but wait until you hear who gave them the idea. People thought I was crazy walking around with a computer, you know, they said, whoa, wow. When I was in high school, people used to call me Computer Steve, you know, it's like, you got this computer attached to you, why? Because Steve Mann is a cyborg, so he has a computer attached to his head at all times. Over the years, I've had different kinds of connections to my self. He's also Garten and Amini's former professor. Eight years ago, he recruited them to stage a special concert. Listeners were wired to make music with their thoughts. For Garten, it was a light bulb moment. I realized there's something of interest there, because, hey, I mean, we're controlling stuff with our minds. The world needed to know about this. So in 2007, she formed Interaxon with Amini and Trevor Coleman. Got a good thing to talk about. We're an odd bunch. I think uh, it's, a, it's, a fun, it's a fun group of people to work with here. So far, the company's biggest contract has been with the Canadian government. During last year's Vancouver Olympics, they controlled lighting on the CN Tower, the Canadian Parliament buildings, and Niagara Falls, using only thought control. You had hundreds of people sitting down, like calling their moms, calling their friends in Toronto, saying, look up the tower, you know, this is me, I'm doing it. But their first commercial venture will be more down to earth. iPad games bundled with a headset for $150. And every time you play, you're actually building your brain. You're building your capabilities to focus, to engage, and you're getting feedback that shows you how you've done. Coleman admits the technology still has to overcome some hurdles. So people do have to be sitting still uh, in order to engage with it effectively because strong muscle activity will override the signals. Um, also, the fact that people are not quite ready to wear things on their head all the time. But Ariel Garten says those are just growing pains for a technology that'll soon be so huge we won't even know it's there. You could have a coffee maker that would turn on when you started to wake up. It would know when your REM cycle was coming and then it would start your coffee. We can control stuff, lights, motors, music, your computer, your iPhone, with your mind. I'm thinking of all the things I could control with my thoughts just about now. Cleaning the house, taking out the trash, wouldn't that be nice? Up until now, Interaxon has been self-funded, but the company is raising money over the next four to six months in advance of the launch of their consumer product line.